Yeah, go dummy, pal. Boy, I just got out the gutter and now you just see me. I tell you, I tell you I'm different. I switch in the lane, that man ain't be doing, but fuck my nigga, I'm different. I run up and shut up, so look what I'm doing. Welcome back, homie. Man? Yeah, it's me. I got somebody who wants to meet you. I just walked in the door. I got to work out at 6. Just an invitation, no pressure, but I'll text you the spot. Later. Jay, I'm Jesse Ashir with Jordan Brand. Hey. Have a seat. It's nice to finally meet you. You have no idea how long I've been chasing this meeting. Really? I, mean, I never considered myself a hard guy to get in touch with. <laughs> well, I'm not the type to just slide into the DMs. I like to be introed from a trusted source. I guess I'm old school. What's up? <laughs> Listen, Jay, I know we're all busy. What's up, man? Hey, man. Did you ever sit this close before? No, sir. I mean, I've sat on a bench before, but this is a little different. Yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Hey, make sure you get to know these courtside season ticket holders once the season starts. You know the reality, man. The clock runs out on everybody, but with these folks, if you play your cards right, they'll be there to help you with the transition. Okay, cool. I got to tell you, when I first bought the Mavs, immediately called me the tech guy. They, they thought I was out of my mind, man. I guess can't blame them. I mean, I just paid more for the Mavs than any team ever, and we were the laughing stock of the NBA. <laughs> we're not laughing anymore. Maybe not quite as loudly, but. Yo, Shay, thought that was you lamping courtside. Ain't seen you since USA trials, right? JJ, what's up, man? Yeah, I miss those days. Glad I ran into you. I just wanted to get in your ear about Under Armour. Thought about a merch deal at all? Hey, not too much, but I'm open. Cool, cool. 
It's funny, man. You get in the league, think you've made it. That's when it all really starts. I think people got expectations in college ball. Just wait. So look, I ain't gonna blow smoke, but I spoke to corporate. I told them they should bring you on. Are you serious? Hey, good looking up, man. We're building something, Che. On the court and in the community. Havoc sounds rocking this year is serious. Traction was crazy, too. All right. What about that signature? Ah, patience, bro. <laughs> hey, you keep baptizing dudes in the lane, it's going to happen. We'll see. They had me in some dope exclusive. What are those? Right? Them, them things are fresh. Thanks, man. But I'm telling you, come right. Little birdie tells me you're hearing sneaker pitches? What time is it, Z? It's 4.30. I only need like three hours of sleep. Dude, you're like a freaking vampire. Yes, look, if you want to take meetings, let's meet with everybody, okay? A lot of new players in the game. You got Puma, Lanning, Reebok's making a push. You got to let me set this up. All right, whatever, man. Look, just don't bother me until daylight, all right? Yeah, sure. Dude. My girl, soft and shit like a strawberry. Yo, them Freddy Kruegers is tight, right? Man, these are dope. How much? Man, no clue, Che. Man, you Jerry Lorenzo, fear of God. Yeah, you Che that dude. <laughs> What's up, man? Nice to meet you, man. You too. Your agent didn't tell you I was coming by? Nah, you know, he said somebody from Nike, but I thought it was gonna be a sales rep, not you. Oh, man, I heard it was you, and uh, I had to make the trip, bro. Man, I appreciate it, man. No doubt, no Yo, doubt. You know I copped a knockoff pair of your van collabs freshman year. Haha, <laughs> I gotta send you the authentics, bro. You serious? Yeah, I got you, man. No problem, man. More importantly, I gotta get you in them new fear of gods. Man, that Nike collab is fire. Oh, thanks so much, man. You know, that thing was built on pure conviction, man. That thing came straight from the heart, straight from the soul. You know, I had the choice to either color up an Air Force One and put my spin on it, or work with Nike to propose something new to the world. And that's something new. It's very successful, bro. And that's why I asked to sit with you, man. You know, swimming against the tides, you know, it ain't easy, man, but that's where greatness is born. You look at Allen Iverson, man. That guy came into the league and they had to change the rules because of him. Put in a dress code, you know? <laughs> right. I just came to say, man, that the way that Nike believed and embraced me, I believe they'll do the same for you. And you just gotta ask the question to yourself, man. Are you in this to play the game or disrupt it? Sir. There he is. Ready to rap. So. What up, Spider? Most definitely. You know, Mom, man, she can't stop talking about you, man. <laughs> you gonna toss that up for the spike like that? <laughs> no, nah, I meant that she's talking about you staying in school and standing up for your teammates, man. For sure, man. I respect what you do off court, too, bro. Showing up the fans' barbecue, paying for the iPhones. <laughs> Big homie is a saint of Salt Lake. <laughs> yeah, man. Mom still got me trying to further my education, though. You know, GCDS, baby. The least I can do is finish my degree. I respect that, man. One question, though. What's up? What comes first? Degree or MVP? <laughs> Gotta get that hardware, bro. But don't tell her that. <laughs> <laughs> so what you think of the dimes, bro? Hey, man, those joints are fresh. <sighs> Determination over negativity. Kind of resonates, don't it? I think I'm gonna get it tatted on my forehead. Don't do that, bro. I own the copyright. <laughs> I got mad lawyers now. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Shay, you already know Adidas has a serious stable. Thing is, we just got our own lane. You know, I'm low-key, driven. Dame's always keeping it 100 with the fans. KP is straight hilarious, man. <laughs> and Harden is... Harden's just a beard, right? Hey, super fly like a hoop. Facts. Point is, if you sign with us, you're not just another dude on the roster. You're Shay. You control your message. And that's real power. All right. Got a question for you. If I sign with you guys, you gonna let me get the keys to the range? <laughs> nope. 
Come on, man. I thought we was boys. <laughs> I'll spare you the legalese. They're all pretty much the same thing with a performance escalator if you make the rookie team or the all-star game, etc. Any of these jump out at you? Honestly, all of them. I feel like whoever I go with, I'm disrespecting someone else. It's not like I had random suits pitching me. <sighs> uh, okay. There's no friendship between the lines, Jay. You know that. This is business. And look, all of those guys realize that you have to do what's best for you. Come on, man. This is the best part. Free gear, free shoes. Smile, come on. What do you think, Z? Well, uh... <laughs> I'm your agent. I'm not your girlfriend. I just set the table and go over the finer points of the deal. But, you know, you're the one who's got to be comfortable with the decision. Did anyone go out of their way to talk to you? Who do you feel you can grow with? <clears throat> there are no bad options on this table. That's the truth. Okay, let's talk NBA workouts. You are not doing any head-to-heads, yeah? Just interviews and drills. And if we get a guarantee from a top 15, we'll probably just shelf you until the draft. Okay, so ball. You, my friend, you have some tough choices. Okay, yes, there are a lot of teams coming in, but you are competing against dudes that are above you and below you. So this is a great opportunity for you to move up, but you could just as easily slide. Plus, you gotta consider fatigue. I mean, Che, these are some serious workouts. You try to hit too many of them, you could wear down. So I strongly considered what teams I was gonna work out with. So I chose the Lakers as my first choice, Orlando Magic as my second, and then I chose the Charlotte Hornets as my third. So now, we're eventually working out with the Lakers. As we pulled up to the practice facility, it was a little bit different. As soon as I walked in, we already doing the drill. It was crazy to me. It was it was different. I've never just walked in the gym without even stretching and hopped straight on the court. So I didn't complain, just went out and had to go hoop. You already know how I do. After the workout with the Lakers, I went on to go with the Hornets to work out. After destroying them in the practice, I went on and took my talents down south to Orlando, Florida. I went on to the Magic's workout and I was going crazy. They couldn't stop me. Just a few weeks before the draft, and we had to put on the show for the, for the team.